I started my meditation 14 years ago. Before I meditate, I make my own business and stay in 38th Street, downtown of Yangon City. And that area is business area. No meditation center near my, my place, near my home. One day I was invited for five day meditation retreat. That is 10 miles or 20 kilometers far away from my place. I go there for listening to mother and one hour for sitting meditation. I continue five days. That five day retreat make me interested in Buddha teaching and Meditation, meditation, and then I'm trying to meditate at home. In the beginning, it is very difficult because of the noise of the surrounding and the cars passing through. Because of my own practice, I came to understand meditation is necessary, and listening the matter or reading Buddhist literature is useful for everyone, especially for me. So I try to learn Buddhist teaching, not only by literature, but also by my own practice. I continue learning Buddhism, not only by listening to my dog, but also my own practice for nearly three years. And then I can abandon my business work and also my life as a layman. In this way, I became a monk 13 years ago. Before I became a monk, I have been a student. I was educated in Yangon University. That's why I know about education and the life of students by my own experience. Besides, I have been working my own business for seven years. That's why I know about business and the life of a businessman by my own experience. When I meditate for nearly three years, I know about meditation and the life of a yogi by my own experience. Compare with education and business, the practice or action of meditation and doing good deeds is complete, perfect. There is no side effect in practicing meditation and doing good deeds. That's why I was satisfied with the practice of meditation and the life of a yogi and the life of a monk. In this way, I became a monk because of loving in meditation and loving the life of Buddha and his followers. As soon as I became a monk, I have a chance to teach meditation daily in the monastery I was staying. And then I continued my teaching at home where the owners were invited to me for breakfast and lunch. I make my teaching at hospital where the patients or the owner of the patients invited to me for teaching. After continuous teaching for five years, I can establish my first meditation center in 45th Street. It is so not far away from the 38th Street where I started my meditation in downtown. That 45 Street Meditation Center is still running. Over 100 yogis are living and meditating there. There are also meditation retreats twice a month in 45 Street. My scan meditation center started in 2008, one year after 45 Street Meditation Center. My scan meditation center was located in Tanya, 45 minute drive from Yango. Now, nearly 2,000 
and 500 yogi are living. There are also three meditation retreat per month. The political situation started a great change in Myanmar in 2012. Politics became free, so also the journalists can write freely. That's why more and more people are knowing about my center. It makes me easy to make new meditation center and retreat around the country. At the present time, there are about 40 meditation center around the country. These are belong to me. These all are the result of practicing meditation and doing good deeds. If you meditate seriously, you can change your life and also you, you can change your surrounding. The practice of meditation and doing good deeds can fulfill our desire and also can fulfill the need of the village, the need of the people. You can rely on meditation and doing good deeds for whatever you need. It is the safest way to do. Yesterday evening, so you said that um, when um, we are meditating, uh, there is no I or we are meditating. Uh, so I don't know, I don't understand. Uh, is that uh, uh, meditation means that we have um, we have uh, actions. It's not that uh, what uh, it's not that uh, only uh, natural. Uh, arise in body and mind. Uh, uh, if if you uh, say if saying that there is no I am meditating or uh, we are meditating, so uh, is that the uh, five of we are uh, meditating or Naman Pa is meditating? Can you explain from The truth is ever new and permanent nature which can also be called Five aggregate or Nama and Rupa. The true impermanent nature or five aggregate or Nama and Rupa is not something, not someone. We cannot grasp the truth as mine. The truth is not someone, no I, no you, no living beings, not something, not non living beings. We think living beings are real, the truth. We think non-living beings are also real. In fact, the intelligence we are using now is not real. That's why whatever understanding appear in our mind are also not real. If we don't understand like this, we are using the wrong understanding. Unreality cannot understand the reality. Created truth cannot understand the original truth. Created truth cannot understand the created truth. Created truth cannot understand itself as created truth. Only the original truth can understand both created truth and original truth. That's why no one is listening, no one is teaching. Just cause and effect. Listening the mother and teaching the ma are doing good deeds. Good action will make good result, good effect. Bad action will make bad result, bad effect. When we meditate or when we listen the mother or when we study Buddhist literature or when we do our daily activity in society, we must try to use this right understanding. We must value the truth. We must love the truth. We must not forget the truth. In this way, we are relying on the truth and the truth will be reliable for us. The nature of the truth is the most powerful 
in universe. That's why if we are connected to the truth, we are safe. Our desire will be fulfilled by the truth. If we are able to rely on the truth, we will be the one with the truth. We need no one, no special one to rely on. We will not need even our own life. In this way, we can be free from wrong understanding and attachment. We can be free from all suffering. We must understand the truth that we must meditate, we must learn Buddhist literature, we must keep research as much as we can, and we must do good deeds for all. We must have our own experience about doing good deeds. With this bright understanding, we all must, we all must try to have our own good deeds more and more. In this way, we can change our life, we can change our place, we can change our society. So, uh, if there is no living being, so who is the so what is uh, compassion? No living being, so how can have compassion? You mean loving kindness? Loving kindness. There is no living beings, no man, no woman, no human, no animals. But there are knowing this truth and not knowing this truth. All our physical and mental problems occur because of not knowing this truth. If we know the truth, we can be free from physical and mental problems. That's why uh, compassion should be not to the person, not to the poor people, not to the animals, but to their wrong understanding or wrong view. Compassion to wrong view. I'm also helping various kinds of people who are in need, including Meditator, with compassion, not to him, not to her, but to, to her ignorance, but to, to the ignorance and wrong understanding in him or her. But if someone sees from the side of human, they cannot understand like this. They may understand, I am pity to all is and patient. I, I am helping to people who are in need. In fact, I am helping them to be free from wrong view. They may be educated or not, they may be healthy or not, they may be rich or not. I am not interested in their situation. I am interested whether they are free from wrong understanding and attachment or not. This is the right, the right way of using only without wrong view and attachment. I'm not saying to make donation only. I said to do all the good deeds, especially practicing meditation. Making donation must be done with right understanding, which is to do only, to experience only, to know only, not to reject and not to attach. Ease of the action of doing good deeds must be free from mistake. Helping others is right, but helping with the wrong view of I or you is wrong. So when we do good deeds, we must be careful not to make mistakes in each of our action. Which means each of our doing good deeds must be doing only, without attachment. In this way, we can understand about doing good deeds more. If we do more, we can do more. In this way, doing good deeds will be our own job. We will also be the real person who do only good deeds. To do good deeds is to become the job of doing good deeds our own. Besides, the life of doing good deeds to become the life of doing good deeds our own. If 
the job of doing good deeds is our own and the life of doing good deeds become our own. We are safe. If we have this ability, we are complete. We can be everything because of owning good deeds. So we must try to do like this and and also we must help others to understand like this and to be able to do like this. I'm also helping Ada to understand like this. My aim is to understand like this and to own good deeds like me. It will take time, but it is possible. I have to help others because they cannot rely on their own deeds. They doesn't own the life of good deeds. That's why they have to rely on me. I help them to be able to stand on their own good deeds. If we understand like this and if we are doing like this, it is right. It is complete. <laughs> When I meditate more and more, I came to understand that the practice of meditation and doing good deeds are concerned with everyone. But for most of the people in the society cannot meditate, cannot do good deeds. They are busy with their home, with their family, with their works. Because I came to understand the truth, that's why it is my responsibility to solve this problem as much as I can. That's why I try to do good deeds as much as I can. Not only in the life of a monk, but also in the life of a lay person. I understand the truth, understand the, what is necessary for the people in the, in the society. I understand what caused the problems of the society. I understand how to solve the problem, but I understand it will take time. It needs a lot of continuous effort. It needs a combination of the help of many people. With this right understanding, I do as much as I can. I do good deeds which I have chance to do. The more I take the chance to do good deeds, the more chance to do good deeds are coming to me. I don't deny not to do good deeds. In this way, I try to fulfill the need of the society. For the OEs also, they can, they can do good deeds as much as they can. They can go to meditation center. They can meditate at home. They can abandon normal life and normal activity. Also, they can participate to be better society by doing good deeds as they can. In the society, people are connected to each other. What we are doing is the same as other. No much different from each other. So if we are trying to change our life, our action is the best way to change the action of the others in the society. We must believe this truth and we must continue to practice like this. In this way, there will be meditation center and meditation retreat in our society and then more and more old age and patients and people can participate to do good deeds. It will take time. We must be patient. We must work hard. We must be dutiful to the good deeds we are doing. There's the problem. So also there's the answer. We must try to solve the problem by doing what we should do.
So they fight uh, to find a very difficult to practice with the place and we are even now uh, um, on their uh, uh, study Dharma is uh, um, staying very uh, in our way. The practice of meditation is uh, even uh, weaker uh, to once we understand and to once we know that uh, in the Sutta we are rich, that we need to be mindful um, from the, when we wake up until we sleep. Uh, but for other um, people like uh, her, they are too long, too difficult, because too many need to worry and uh, why you know, just um, remember to be mindful for a while. And then uh, some uh, thing uh, comes, and then uh, so you have to uh, deal with that, uh, to think of that. And uh, even with the uh, doing good things, uh, like uh, the domination, you also have a lot of difficulty. Uh, even so you have to uh, hear from the people in the uh, surrounding center, even no, no uh, money to live. Uh, how they to work their lesson then uh, uh, the studying the Amma and the meditation itself is already difficult but we also have a lot of uh, difficulty uh, from the society who uh, which are mostly uh, don't know many things and don't follow the way of Dhamma so the uh, we also give her instruction uh, how to, uh, as a uh, layman, uh, uh, we can um, be mindful continuously. What she understands, what she knows is right. She can try to have right understanding like this, but many people in the society does not understand like this. She can help others to understand like her. If more and more old age and young people are understanding like her, it will be more and more easy to solve this problem. This is not our own problem. The, this problem is suffering in most of the old age. I go around the country and I go to some foreign country, I experience like this. I know the problems, besides I know the way to solve the problem. I can solve the problem, that's why I'm helping. That's why I'm going around the country, even to the mountain, difficult to go, and then I'm helping them to understand like this and to be able to do good deeds. The same problem, the same solution. Now, one of the, the power center will take care of who is patients and families who are in need already exist in Myanmar. That's why it is not much difficult to be one after another because seeing is believing. Many people in the society, not only Myanmar people, but also foreigners are knowing about doing good deeds in my center. That's why they believe in doing like this and they will also try their best to be like this. That's why these problems will not exist longer. To be able to solve the problem, we must do good deeds more and more. Now I can do good deeds all the time. It is because of I am doing small good deeds continuously. Everybody cannot to get chance to do great big good deeds, but everybody can have to do small good deeds. So we must use to do small good deeds. The more we do good deeds, the more we will be able to do good deeds. If we are able of doing good deeds in the right way, more and more chance to do good deeds will come to us. Trying to believe in this right understanding and trying to continue doing good deeds, it is the only answer to solve the problem. If there is a will, there will be a way. Now you have a good will and 
this need die, there will be a way to solve this problem. If we can solve other problems, it is not the end. If we can solve this problem, it is the end. This is the real problem we must solve. Doing good deeds is necessary for everyone, every time, everywhere. If we cannot do like this, we are making mistake. We all must correct our own mistake. In this way, everyone can be safe, can be peaceful, can be complete. Mindfulness must be practiced by ourselves to be right. Mindfulness on the present happening, we must be able to detach from the past and future. We must change our habits, thinking about the past and dreaming about the future. We must try to stay at the present time and then we will be able to be mindful more and more. It is the only way we must try to follow this way. We are responsible for each of us. If more and more people are mindful, it will not be difficult to be mindful. True.